How did you know that? Do you have a, a, a physical, earthly father? So he can be your father. So Ronald, uh, just repeat after me. Say, uh, Father God, I love you. And I accept that your son died on the cross for my sins. That you were beaten for my healing. That you were beaten for my healing. And I believe that your son Jesus, that your son Jesus rose, again on the third day. rose again on the third day. And I'm asking you to come into my heart. And I'm asking you to come into my heart. And I just I give my life to you. And I give my life to you. And this is my confession. This is my confession. That you are Lord of my life. That you are the Lord of my life. And that Jesus is King. And that Jesus is King. Amen. Come on. Amen. So good. Amen. You filled with the Holy Spirit with fire. Yeah. <laughs> and you again? That's your bad self. <laughs>
you, you might think of a small voice and you're kind of quiet, but to God, you have the loudest voice to Him. That even, even though you might be in your room alone or whatever, you're praying for those who aren't with you or that you feel like you might not be able to talk to, but you're interceding so strongly and so loud in the presence of the Spirit that you can touch those who are not even close to you, that you can touch those who you might be maybe intimidated to talk to or not feel like you can be loud enough with them, but God just wants to know that He, he is there worshiping with you. That the shoulders right now, the bones and the muscles, is there any more tension, no more pain, no more discomfort? Complete healing from the feet to the soles of their feet right now. Just, just move it out, move it out, move it out, move it out. Right? Move, it out. Move, it out. Move, it out. move that shoulder, move that shoulder. Pain go, pain go. You can do that. Swelling and pain go, come on. At the foot of the throne, on the road, the camera is walking me, walking me, walking me, camera.